Good morning, everyone. Uh, please excuse the mess of this room. This is our bedroom. We don't show it a lot because um, when we're renovating, this room acts as a lot of things. It's a junk room. It's my office when I work and it's our bedroom and it's just, it is what it is at the moment. Um, but you know, I'm not going to hide from it and I certainly wasn't going to clean up for you. So <laughs> you'll have to excuse the mess. I'm filming this over the Easter holidays. Brad and I have taken some time off work and we have 11 consecutive days including weekends to get some things done. Uh, we decided that we would stay home and work on the house because we've been away a lot lately and we're just really excited to get stuck into it. So Brad is currently restumping. There will be a full video about his journey of restumping. There's already been some interesting moments. Uh, I will link that into the description box for you. You can check that out. Um, and I will give you a little update in this video to see how he's cracking on. I'm going to work on the front yard. It's actually raining. I don't know if you can see in the window, but it is raining. I think it's raining for the full next week. Um, but we're just going to keep going on with it anyway. So my mum and I are going to go to the nursery. We're going to get some plants to plant up under my little baby olive trees. And we're also going to get cracking on the pergola this week. I would like to get my, my aim is to get the um, minimum, the posts in the ground for the pergola, so lots of digging and cementing in those posts, but if we can get that done, that'll be a huge step forward for us. I've got my, uh, my big girl boots on, and um, I'm all rugged up, and I'm ready to go. So let's go, and I'll show you Brad on the way through. All right, I'm coming out of my bedroom through the part of the house that we're not renovating, I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you what happens when we walk through this door to get to the kitchen. Here we go. This is the door. <laughs> it's really raining outside. So this is where we are currently at with our renovations. Our kitchen is actually in here. This is where we, um, are cooking it's sort of in the middle of, of all the renovations but we're not going to touch it for now um, so yeah you can see that it is quite bare Brad has actually re-stumped the stumps over here you can see if I'll zoom in you can see the new concrete stump there and he's getting cracking on the rest aren't you Brad um, and at the moment, our walkway are these two planks that run through the house so we can get out the front door. It's a dream. <laughs> Here's my mum. <laughs> we are at the nursery picking out our plants. Bad, whatever it is. I wonder what it is. What's it say? Look at it. It's about to go into bud, whatever it is. See, that's very pretty. Well, what is it? It says it right there. No, it's a fuchsia. That's not it. See, look, it's a different plant. Well, what's this what tag is say? Camellia. Oh yeah, I didn't see it there. Oh, silk screen. Needs a photo. It's hard to know, isn't it? Okay. We're looking for the limes. No, they're lemons. You read for lemons. Forget that. I need full sun lime. <laughs> Don't be rude. You're the one being rude. rude. Oh, you're such a show off. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going off. <laughs> Let's have a think. So, you don't think this is purple enough? No. I this one. It's nice though. Oh, look, yeah. Where's it? Let's take it down to the trolley. Or what about something with a purple flower? Okay. What do you think? No, I don't. I don't actually. What do you think? Well, it doesn't stand out, does it? No. Mum can do. Mum, you do it. You do the the take. Take us through what so we're getting. We have three little pin cushions. Oh. Three grasses and three pretty daisies. Are they daisies? And a lime. And a lime. Well, they look like daisies. And a lime. Okay. And we are done. We have the lime tree in the back. I don't know if you can see it. I'm trying to get, here we go, with a lime tree in the back and everything's in the boot. Mum's just put away the, mum's put away the trolley. Haven't you, Faye? Yes, I have. Ooh. Onwards we go. Good afternoon, everyone. It is a very rainy day. 
yesterday mum and I um, didn't do a lot after we went to the garden centre we kind of just um, you know mucked around and that's important and it's fun you got to have playfulness in your life so that's fine we did buy the plants and I'm ready to plant them up today my dad is gonna come over and help me this week I really wanted to get into the garden start digging out the holes with the pergola plant up under the olives and get some things done uh, the weather hasn't really you know stayed nice for us but we're gonna do it anyway it's okay we can get a bit wet it's fine um, I'll show you around some of the things we've done so these pots are a new addition to the garden I love them I think they're beautiful they're so sculptural so architectural so I want them in the middle here and we'll probably plant around them so they start to feel like they're part of the landscape um, and oh Chai you're so sweet oh look at his little face You're just sitting there. You're just sitting there like a comfy pup. Oh, you're so sweet. Today, Dad and I are gonna start to maybe clear out some of the garden, start to clean it up and make it look a bit like the design that we'd drawn out from the very beginning. So hopefully he'll get here soon and I'm gonna start planting up under the olives. Well, my dad has just left and uh, these are the hands, the red, raw and very dirty hands of someone who has been digging out a blooming bamboo tree. You can see the hole here. I don't know if you can really remember what the tree looks like. Hopefully I did a good shot of it beforehand, but it was just a bit of a, a green blob and we want to put the pergola here. So I had to go and oh my goodness, it took like four hours to get it out of the ground in the rain and uh, the mud. But um, we got there and it's looking good. Well, it's looking bare, which is what we want. So tomorrow I'll probably um, just make sure all of the roots are completely gone because we will have a vegetable garden on top of that and we don't want it to haunt our dreams by growing back. Um, and I will show you the garden that we planted up here under the olives. So it might not look like much, uh, but it will grow hopefully into something beautiful. We have mostly Australian natives underneath our olive trees. The birds are singing beautifully and um, our other ones are starting to look quite lush now in the vegetable garden filled with our winter veggies so they're quite small. We've got our lettuces and stuff but it is coming together and hopefully will grow during autumn, winter and spring to be something lush and beautiful. Looking a little muddy but um, it's going to get there. This little boy Well, oh, sorry, sir. Well, we are both covered in mud and wet, and we've both done some hard work today, haven't we, Chai? Um, so we're going to leave it there. Um, even though it doesn't feel like we did a lot, I think that each part makes. <laughs> I think part each part makes a huge. Deal. Can I help you? I'm trying to do a vlog. Often with these kinds of projects, it's a kind of... I can hear Brad in the background <laughs> re-stomping the house. With these kinds of projects, it's a... Uh, it's every single step, even if it feels small, makes a huge difference to the end product. And each time we do something, it certainly makes it feel more like ours. And we are getting there and um, we've got to wait for the garden to grow. It's not as... Um, it's not as an instant gratification kind of thing we have to wait for the garden to grow in so probably in spring they'll start looking beautiful so um, fingers crossed this little dog needs all of the cuddles he can get I'm gonna go wash my hands and start some dinner and um, I hope you have a wonderful 
night yourselves wherever you are in the world if you haven't subscribed to our videos please do it makes a huge difference um, and we love having you join us thank you bye yes yes you're a good boy oh